Hello class, my name is James Cross. My self-project goal is for me to run three miles a week. Being able to do this will help me with my family past heart disease. I wanted to choose running as my goal for a couple of reasons. Of course, to strengthen my heart, but also to help myself be the best athlete as possible and to learn how to control my heart rate. To measure these things, I've decided to measure my resting heart rate before running, my recovery heart rate after running, and the time it took me to run a mile that day. I believe these statistics will show progress in all three areas of my goal. My progress so far has been great. Getting started initially was hard, but after the snow melted and I was able to start creating a habit, it had gotten easier to stay committed. Week one was tough because I hadn't figured out a good schedule to start between classes, practice, weights, games, and meals. I successfully ran two out of three times in week one. My times were seven minutes, 48 seconds, and seven minutes, 55 seconds, with heart rates of 62 before and 75 after for the first run, and 67 before and 76 after for the second run. Week two was actually canceled for me because of the snow. I wasn't able to get outside and run and do those things, but I found alternative cardio in the weight room. I ended up rowing on the row machines a few miles uh, each time I went in. Week three was awesome for my progress. Being stuck inside all that time because of the snow really made me want to get outside and be active. My first run of the week was ran in seven minutes, 43 seconds, with a before heart rate of 68 and a recovery heart rate of 74 beats per minute. Run number two of the week was ran in seven minutes, 45 seconds, with a before heart rate of 67 and a recovery heart rate of 77 beats per minute. My third and final run of week three was ran in seven minutes, 32 seconds. This was my best mile from the first four weeks. My resting heart rate was 65 and my recovery heart rate was 77 beats per minute. Week three was a step in the right direction for both my heart health and creating a habit. Week four was a direct result of week three. After being able to successfully run three out of three miles, it was easier to do it again. My first mile of week four was ran in seven minutes and 50 seconds with a resting heart rate of 67 and a recovery heart rate of 75 beats per minute. Run number two was ran in seven minutes, 45 seconds, with a before heart rate of 66 and a recovery heart rate of 75 beats per minute. Run number three of week four was ran in seven minutes and 40 seconds. Each run this week was faster than the previous. This run had a resting heart rate of 70 and a recovery heart rate of 74 beats per minute. With the first four weeks down, I can honestly say I feel like it is helping me in more ways than I thought. Running these miles has helped me clear my head when I've been overthinking or stressing about life. Sports has always been my escape from the real world, and I guess running helps me in that way too, even if it is only eight minutes a day. After investing the time and effort to create this habit, I know it will stick. I don't feel like it is a burden anymore, but more like an activity I'm beginning to enjoy. I've learned a lot about myself through the first few weeks. Being able to pick my own goal to challenge myself is how I work best. This falls into the confirming self-identity trait for me. I know my limits and how well I can do, so being able to push myself is essential. The other thing that motivates me to keep pushing my goal is the environmental motivator. A person's health is all they really have in this life, so I want mine to be the best condition possible. A couple barriers that I have had to overcome are more psychological than physical. I tend to have a fixed mindset when it comes to most things and believe whatever happens is meant to happen. And the more I researched how running affected heart health, the more I realized I was wrong. The other barrier I lacked was practical knowledge. If I hadn't researched my goal, I would have never known heart disease was preventable. I don't think I need to change anything going forward. I feel like the degree of difficulty is just right for my situation. Having a busy schedule as it is makes these days tough enough. For the second half of the class, hopefully I won't miss a run. The 10 minute rule is actually perfect for my goal. It takes me a little less than 10 minutes to run, but after I take my heart rate, it totals to about 20 minutes to do the entire task for the day. 
As for the future, hopefully I'll be able to continue to run and improve on these goals even after the semester is over. Heart health and longevity is ultimately the main goal.